I want to say that this series, as you can see, is a gaming series. There are different colors. You can see all these supports. Here is a pillow in the cervical part for the head and the lumbar support is really very well done. I'm very curious to see what color is this new arrival and how much bigger and everything. Let's start immediately with the unboxing. Here we are guys. Let's start unboxing this and I use this cutter even though it says not. But surely you have to cut it. We start cutting slowly without ruining anything. Here we go. So guys. Here we have opened this package and we have this. It is very heavy, really heavy. I think it is heavier than my last base for the wheels. This is the basis of the chair. Then we have the guide, which I have also found in the other chair. Everything perfectly written as it should be. Also made of very premium material. Okay guys, we have a crazy backrest. Now let's open the cover and particularly show you the back plate. It should be fantastic. This is a lot. It's heavy. This does not have a pillow on the head I think. Or maybe yes, I don't know. And very very solid. Very nice. It feels really nice, really nice. Let's try it. Now I want to give it a try. Put them on comparison so if you want to buy these fantastic series, you can understand more or less the greatness. If I take this with one hand, it will be very difficult. I put it next to this. More or less they are similar. However, this is bigger. It is large for most people. It looks very beautiful. We continue the unboxing. We have the armrests of the chair in beautiful red that are practically equal to the other model. Maybe slightly bigger. Look how cute the color is. It is solid, heavy and beautiful. Let's put it here for a moment. Then the second armrest. But first I would like to pull up this one, which is so much heavy. The chair is excellent at a great price. Look at this, very nice. Let's shoot from another angle. It's all really top padding and it's much wider than my last chair. Mine is more gaming chair, this more armchair. And the armchair has very nice ecological leather. I think it is beautiful, very beautiful. This one is smooth but less rounded. It also looks beautiful but definitely smaller. So if you need a chair smaller, you should take this. If you want a chair bigger and more comfortable in the widest sense, you have to take this absolutely. Inside the package then we have all the various pieces to be constituted onto this chair base. Now I unpack them and get everything prepared. We see from the instructions. You have to take this, which is to go to align these four screws. A hex key is provided. We use this to undo those four screws and mount this mechanism onto the seat. I made it very simple. Now I'm going to mount armrests. Practically the first step I did is removing screws and avoid putting them here and there. Then I go to fasten the armrest with the helicoid threaded inserts inside the seat. Completed. Very easy and fast. Now what you have to do is practically take this hole, turn the whole chair. Take it here to slip exactly onto this gas lift. And that's it guys. You can adjust the seat level to the appropriate point. I want to point out something else. As you can see, this is wider than the other. You see well here. Have a look at the backrest and the seat. 
Now you have to put the cover on the part where there is the lever to raise, lower and to pull down the backrest. It seems very simple and I'll show you when it's all done. Finally complete after an hour of assembly. We have finished it and I'll show you the differences between the two series. They have the same height. This one is certainly wider than this. As you see, this is smaller in shape. More or less this is the same, although not having the support of a pillow for the head to a pillow in here. And this is very comfortable. The thing I found very different between these two chairs is this part here. It practically acts as the backbone and replaces the lumbar pad. The lumbar cushion in this smaller one can be raised and lowered. And this is very comfortable in a different setting. Wider in my opinion and more of an office type to be clear. The seat is also very wide and the armrests are very large and distant from each other. Then you see here we can clearly put the armrests inwards. And with the levers that are both there at these peaks, then we can lower and raise the arm lines. Then here is another lever to lower and raise the chair and put a stability position. And there is also a lever for the backrest to lower and raise. So these are two seats that really make of excellent quality. I'll show you the details for a moment, so you understand the quality. Unlike many chairs that you find online that cost around 100 euros, surely these are of clearly superior quality and the finishes are excellent. I have seen the other gaming chairs that seem to break at any moment, but these two chairs are really solid. These plastic inserts are very solid. Cushions are top level. These are all top cushions. So there is nothing more to say, you just have to choose which one it is your series.